Hello and welcome, this is me, Mr. Marbrit, with yet another LEGO Worlds video. And as you can see, we've got a showcase model 62. Right, it is, as you can probably see, it's a massive LEGO brick with the 60 years on the side. And we have three vehicles, we've got ourselves a train, a spaceship and a boat. And we've also got a castle down at the bottom. Ah, right, um, I actually know why and what this is all about but I'm not going to mention just yet because we're going to save the model and then we're going to find somewhere for it so uh, we'll be back in just a moment right so we're back we are in the sandbox uh, brick build area and the reason I chose this is because it's the build we've got is a hasn't got a, a treasure chest so uh, being, being the build it is so we thought well it just seemed wise to come in here so we are in my sandbox area uh, my sandbox town I should say uh, as we've so called probably. so we've got like the 1950s uh, brick builds there and we've also got the Ghostbusters brick build that I've also done a video for and I've done the guide for it's 11 11 videos <coughs> reason being there's so many, so many videos the only simple reason is because of how complicated the build is so we got our giant size man and our giant size tt so i'm going to put the brick build here oh, and i've got the airport over there which we are working on at the moment uh so when i decide when i come up with some extra stuff that i want to i'm going to do some build for i'm going to do the guide for so you guys out there can do it as well if you want to right so uh as you can see we are the police officer so we're going to go into our discovery tool and we're going to go into our brick builds and then we're gonna flick across and we're gonna go down to our showcase and i wonder if it's in here is it gonna no it's not gonna be in here why not why not uh right let's go let's just go in here as a normal on normal mode and we might hopefully be able to find what we're looking for if not then we're gonna look very very silly <laughs> right it is in here somewhere i know it is i know it is i know it is oh you showcase model Oh. <gasps> there it is right at the bottom right so oh, wow well, wow well, this is i'm going to turn you around because it's going to look a bit oh, oh, bring it down oh, oh. it's this is uh, quite a complicated affair go forward a bit go forward a bit a little bit more yeah. go down? no 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 Wrong one. Right, I might need to knock it down. No, I don't want to go down actually. No. Oh, we just had it perfect then. And we jumped. Let's come back a bit. Bring it up. Oh, there we go. Perfect. So we're going to pop this in. And now, the reason they've done this is as of the 28th of uh, January. Uh, 1958 at 1.58 p.m. The original pattern by Godfred Kirk Christian was signed. Now, what that basically means is when Lego first came about, it was invented by an Englishman and a company, uh, a Danish company or Danish, uh, yeah, Danish company come up with, thought, looked at it and thought, well, hang on, we could do some better with this. So, uh, since then, uh, the Danish construction toy has exploded to become the global brand with minifigures and sets found in almost every child's bedroom in the UK. The first ever bricks to be made in the 1950s will still snap together into the newest ones made today. Uh, before their official... Oops, before their official patenting... Pat, pat, patenting... Or whatever it is in 1958 the bricks were named automatic binding bricks until the name logo was conceived from the danish word leg got meaning play well today is the big moment for the bricks only five years until they get free bu free bus passes and to celebrate uh yeah to celebrate the the, the birthday they uh, basically held a, a competition and a uh, a child uh, yeah a, a nine-year-old 
Sienna was invited to Denmark to see how the de designs were. She also come up with, uh, a, she actually won the competition of designing her own design, uh, which was for the uh, Lego Friends um, park. She basically designed a park. But so, so the reason we got this is because it's the 60th birthday as of two days ago. Yeah, but we only just got this today, which is a bit, mm, seems a bit odd, but that's how it goes, I suppose. So we're gonna have a, we're gonna have a closer look. So we got ourselves a castle down at the bottom here. We got ourselves some water there. Can we actually go in the water? No, it's solid, unfortunately. That would have been really cool if it was more, you could actually go into, I suppose you could, you could effectively just change that with the uh, paint gun. So we got ourselves our castle, which is classic, classic build for, for Lego. Uh, then we got ourselves a ship. Um, then we got ourselves the train, uh, which came out. I think it was uh, late seventies they bought the train set out. And then we got the the classic space set, which if I go back a bit, I'm gonna go all the way back here, so we can see it properly in all its glory. Right, there we go. So I know it's not it's because it's such a massive massive build I mean it's like compared to that one to my to my, my man my Lego man there it's it's huge and I'm gonna climb up the side here just to see how high this really is so we got our we got the Lego 60 there on the side there oh, there's the spaceship there we go there's the spaceship which I don't think you're going to be able to use. Uh, and then, as you can see, it is ridiculously high. Now, I think the closest building we've got height-wise is the one over there, which is the town hall, if I remember rightly. Uh, so that is the closest uh, brick build that we've got that pretty much comes closest. So we're going to have a closer look at this. So we've got some, some gluey studs there. A spaceship. We've got our other spaceship, which, by the way, if you have got the uh, the the space pack, oh, not space pack, the space DLC, classic space DLC, then you will know you'll be familiar with that. And then we've also got ourselves the Lego train, which is looking pretty quirky. Which I'm hurt, which would be nice if it actually did put one of them in. My, I actually, I have actually messaged uh, Lego Worlds to find out about um, the possibility of us getting. Oh, oh what's in the back here? No, let's go in the back. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, looks like we got ourselves some uh, other bits more there. So we got ourselves like a pirate ship there. Uh, but yeah, so I've messaged them to find out what were the chances of, of us. Oh, getting some lego wheels because uh, we got the bricks and um, we just haven't got the wheels and i think what would make it really really good would be if we could actually make cars you know what i mean make our own certificates i know we've got vehicles in it but to be able to to make our own vehicles with uh, the tire tracks for like tanks and and other bits and bobs and even trains make our own trains which would be good uh, and I know they actually did put a train in on the uh, monster pack um, so but yeah so I'm just waiting to find out hear back from them if they do decide to do that um, but all in all it's quite a nice a nice brick build um, so I'm just wondering if we're gonna be getting any more like that for our next batch or what the next lot of stuff is um, but like I said before we have done the we've done the Ghostbusters Ghostbusters brick build, which is that one there. Uh, which I'm going to try and do. I'm going to try and do the sign if I can uh, for it because I think that would look pretty quirky. And obviously, there's the interior, that's the ground floor. We got our second floor. Oh, and we got stairs. My character's trying to climb. And then we got, there we go, and there's some more. But yeah, um, that's our Ghostbusters. But yeah, like, like I said, we have got the Brick Build Guide for that, and that's 11 videos. If you are like 11 videos, that's a bit much, you would understand when you see how complicated it is to build it. It doesn't look complicated at all, but it was quite a quite a complicated build. Oh, no, close, not hit, close the door. Thank you. Um, and there's my Pugsy's bit 
bit uh, swamped in green bricks. Why is that doing that? There we go. Uh, anyway, if you like anything, if you like what we do around here, and I have got some ideas up my sleeve, uh, my next brick build, which I will do the guy for, I'm going to try and I'm aiming to do it in either one or two videos. So it will be a shorter, uh, won't be so much uh, there. Um, if you enjoy this video and you enjoy any of my other videos then feel free to subscribe and follow and if you're new to the channel and you do both of them then you will be notified of the next video and you'll become the newest member of the notification squad i'll get that i'm getting a bit mixed up there uh, but anyway also thank you to everyone who has checked out the videos watched them subscribed smash the thumbs up comment if if you have 30 questions or more or anything like that and you think well how do i do this don't feel free don't hesitate to ask me and i will do my hardest to explain if or if you're struggling on anything also if you are over 30 and you play lego then i have the over 30s ps4 lego worlds group on facebook so other ganders on that uh we're on there we're, we're quite a friendly bunch you know what i mean and it's family fun friendly like the videos like let go but i think i think that's pretty much it really so as you can see that's massive that thing is huge isn't it it's just almighty tower of pure red lego brick and i think that's pretty quirky there next to the uh, the lego man i might stick one on the other side actually i think that would look pretty cool i'll see what i'll see we'll, we'll probably think about that um and probably put some lights in it as well just to light it up a bit because <laughs> it's getting dark and there's not a great deal you can see in that so we might, might add some lights to it and i'll probably show that off in the next video uh, <laughs> but anyway as ever i've been you've been fabulously awesome i've been Mr. and i shall catch you on another one soon peace bye